Hello, hello. We're here. Big thanks to Christopher for all the, the big ups and uh, the all oohs. I'm sure are plenty of there. Yeah. Good evening. Welcome to Bungle After Dark. <laughs> <laughs> so, hello, John Saunders, Darren Cheshire. Ooh, PO box opening a more. Yep, that's uh, that's what we're about to tonight. We're going to open the stuff that has been sent to our PO box. Not the stuff that's been sent in the last week. We picked it up a, a week yesterday. Just gone. Was it a week yesterday? Something Give or like take. That. Something like that. So if you send something this week, it won't be there. So don't want anyone getting uh, unduly excited. But there's plenty of things to open. Got nine, ten. Nine or ten or eleven <laughs> things to open. Yeah, Bunga so. looks younger today because <clears throat> uh, he's had a, a haircut from <laughs> myself and uh, a beard trim. But uh, he set the wrong setting on the moustache trimmer. And Beard like trimmer. Got... Moustache sounds like well. something from the 1930s. <laughs> Mustachio. Well, he doesn't look like he's got a moustache anymore. No. Yes, I did. So Lady M's giving me a haircut as well. So you probably can't really see from where it is, but I have had a haircut. Yeah. And uh, she kindly trimmed my beard as well. So I give her the beard trimmer with the, the settings I was after. And uh, unfortunately, it was a little <laughs> shorter than normal. So I look a little bit younger than normal. Mm. So I know we look my age, which is 29. 29 next birthday anyway yeah and look a little bit younger probably could pass them maybe 20 21 i think right i think on there so plus how many yeah no that's fine <laughs> hello keith cameron hello jamesy boy jamesy boy's asking why the boy's hosting tonight yeah very good very good i do think my, my hair's a little bit the the, the, the fringe has got a bit, li, a bit to be desired mine but it's the best we can do we'll see after we've had a bath yeah makamula bungle's younger brother thank you <laughs> <laughs> Plenty of ooze, thank you, Chris Officer. Sixteen hundred and sixty six. Darren Coles. Edward Evans, Paul Dodge, hello. Who's Hi Rob Callie. Who's Robert Irwin? I don't know. Apparently you look like a younger Robert Irwin. Don't know. Handsome <laughs> Bar Steward, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> oh Baby yeah. Bungle. Oh yes. So yeah, oh. there, 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 there yeah. there's there's Baby Bungle there. As sent in by Shiny Pad on a uh, on a PO box, and he is Baby Bungle as well. Baby Bungle the younger. I'm far too young for her, aren't I? More like Steve Irwin. <laughs> what do you mean far too young? For <laughs> she's lucky. She's a lucky woman. Well, a lucky, lucky woman. Hello, Trev, twenty-one year old. Correct. That is absolutely correct. I'm only just older than you. Only just. Wendy Kelly, what made you call it Bungle? Who call it Bungle, or <laughs> it, or it Bungle? I don't know. It. It. Not quite sure. Patrick Woods can't wait. Oh, thanks, James Woodley. Hello, Mr. Green. Hello, Angel Wings. Hello, Shuey. Hope you're enjoying our giveaway prize. Or your giveaway prize, as it is now. <laughs> James, yeah. Brilliant job with the haircut. Mm. Katie Jones says you look about 12. Thank you, Katie Jones. Thank you. I'll take that as a, as a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> Taffy Coins Bungle has finally had his uh, <clears throat> shave. Yeah, don't like saying that word. Social distancing shave. Is what? You know, like bit like a haircut that you did when, while you were locked down. Oh. But yeah, interestingly, yes, the I got my haircut just before lockdown. I didn't get it cut at all until after lockdown. And now because I'm too tight to go and get it cut because <laughs> so many people did their own haircut. I asked Lady M to do it. Well, I did a good job of uh, tech boys. So you tech guys. So yeah. Tech boy, yeah. Tech boy, yeah. Looks like a boy yeah. after you've cut his hair. Lisa Dalton's saying, I think Bungle is lucky to have our Lady M. He absolutely is, Lisa. Mm. Definitely. I think we all knew who got the better. Hi, Alana. Who got the better out of the deal, that's for sure. Mm. Yes, hello, Alana. Now, your dad uh, gave me strict instructions that you need to be in bed by nine o'clock. Yes, it'll be school in the morning. Yeah, so you've, only, you've got nine minutes and then you'll have to watch the rest on catch up, otherwise we're getting into trouble. And I've given Bungle strict, strict, strict instructions that we... Uh, we can't be on as late as we were last week. Dragifster baby face. Took me You've got the cutest little up. baby face, thank you. <laughs> this is, is it a song? The camera. <laughs> no, it's a different camera. We are, thanks to our tech guy, he's rigged up the the uh, webcam rather than using the one on the top of the laptop. So <laughs> maybe that just looks a little fresher. Snatcher. Yes, big time. <laughs> big time. I don't think so. There's months in it. We're really good, thank you, Dave Chamberlain. 
James Woodley yeah, 2011 and IFC. So yeah, we're not, we're not doing any, we're not planning on doing any coin hunts anyway. This is just going to be opening of the PO box. So let's uh, let's show you what we got to open. So just over a week ago, went to the PO box, and uh, we've collected this. So what we've decided to do is uh, we're going to open it live on uh, on here rather than doing it as a PO box video. So if you like watching people open open mail or post letters packages this is the place to be bungle after dark and we open up the after dark packages does anybody recognize their their parcel in there i think i've got a couple of trades in here as well and there's definitely one uh investment so i told you last last week if i was investing in some 2020 bunk coins 50ps there in this there in this parcel here anybody reckon anyone recognize it There's no one around to take your place, babyface. Is again, is that a song? I'm not sure. Maybe. Ooh, bungle, babyface. Yeah, there's definitely a song there. Do you want to start it off? No. You can maybe hum it. <laughs> and I'll let while I while I open the parcels. No, okay. No. Andrew Watson saying yes. So does that mean? Oh, is there something in there? Is there? From the Watson family. Patrick Wood sees his. Richard Harmer's new fetish is PO box watching. Yeah, I, I yeah. What, what did I watch the other day? I can't think what it was. Oh, it was absolutely crazy, you know. Oh, um, there's a guy, a guy who goes to car boot, car boot reseller, Brum reseller, oh, or something like yeah. that. And he he went. What he did was he went and bought twenty unclaimed parcels from the Royal Mail. It was six. There were six pound each. And I watched him open all twenty, and he got absolute rubbish. And it could have been, you know, real. Mm -hmm. Could have been gems. It could have been real gems, real gold. But yeah, forty five minutes just watching him open parcels. So here we are. Why not? Why not? Indeed. Big to small, Andrew Watson was in. Oh, we're going to go small to big. We're going mm. small to big so that it's easy, otherwise it'd be all there. Is it the top of a TV set? I can think, yeah, I think Nick Thomas, I, I, I've got a, there's a, oh, hang on, the camera. I've moved, I've moved our faces, look, we're at the, we're, at the, we're, we're up, yeah, we're up we're there. We're in the corner. We're up there. We're in the top corner today. Oh, hang on. on, hang on, no, hang on. Oh, check you out, where are you going? Are you on <laughs> our side? We are, is that right? Are we up with this corner? Yeah, we're up there, there we go. That's weird, it's backwards and upside down for us. So anyway, we're up here, so we'll have to get ready for that. I'm not I'm thinking, Mr. Top of my head off, which is quite good, but yeah. anywho, anywho, I'll have to say it's all a scam. Oh, is that the uh, the the car boot reseller dude? <laughs> Hopefully, he doesn't mean us. <laughs> With a bit of luck. <laughs> so Touche McBoosh, which has got to be definitely in the top ten greatest YouTube uh, names of all time. But is it is it special? Is it special pineapple? pineapple? We don't know. But it's the same little Two, emoji thing. Yeah, Touche McBoosh. Are you special little pineapple? Because special little pineapple was already a great YouTube name. It was. James James Woodley is moo mooing. S A S A S toast. There, this is where someone has sent in something not so PG. Well, I know it was a bit of a risk that, and we've done. We must have done. 12, 15, 18 PO box openings, and every single time it's been something okay. So hopefully there's nothing uh, there's nothing in there, and we didn't announce it. Of course, we only decided well, we only decided this morning that I was going to do this. So uh, haven't announced it to anyone. So hopefully there's nothing too naughty in here, and hopefully there won't be. We are, we are probably going to. We people have asked us about our Sunday morning live stream, so we're probably going to start doing that from next week, I think. So this will be our last after dark, more than likely. Yeah. We will uh, we'll go back to our 10 a.m. live streams on a Sunday morning. Basically, Alana's telling you to hurry up. She's only got five minutes. Right. Okay. Who do you want it to open, Alana? Who do you want it? Who, who do you want to open yours? Me or Lady M? Because this is yours, isn't it? We know yeah. this, and we know this is Alana's because she has wrote on the bottom. So it's it's been it's been ma mangled like Alana. I'm mm -hmm. afraid. So this is to bungle Ellie and Lady M. PO Box 1070. It is a seven. Stockton on T's. TS 191ZA. So. Everything that gets sent to us gets read out in a video. Oh, it's for me. And there's, uh, <laughs> and there we know it's from Alana. Lady M, please. She's wrote, she's wrote on the bottom there, so we know this there. So Lady M's opening. <laughs> I think it's already slightly opened. Yeah, it's been, yeah. Uh, it's been wrecked, isn't it? Had... So, so we've got no real zoom. Cause the, well, the zoom is a bit out of whack. So if you go, you're gonna hold it up. So what I thought was open it, scan it, because we don't want anyone's yeah, addresses. Just, yeah. yeah. So kind of open it, slide it out. And then have a look. Right, we'll move the other goodies out the way. 
So kind of pull it out and you can put the any prizes down. Right, so put that there. Ooh, that's nice. Right. Okay. Two bungle, Lady M and Ellie, and we've got a brilliant. I'm gonna do a little bit of a zoom. So I've got a. That is awesome sticker. We've got a little bit of a. Can we see that bear there? Is it a bear? Yeah, it is a bear. It's that bright and it's white. I'm not sure what we're yeah. focusing. So it's a bear it's with a balloons. Bear with balloons. Can you can you have too many packages with bears or balloons? So are you happy that? No. Happy there's no personal details on there, Lady M. Right. I'll turn it that way. Oh, am, then, I am I reading it? Right, well, I've opened it. You read it, and then right. I'll open this. Right. Because I thought as well. We'd, it, so, I thought people don't need to actually see it because they can see us. So they can see me reading it here. Ah, like, are we okay, listening? Okay. Are we listening, class? <laughs> okay. To Bungle Ellie and Lady M, I hope you like this coin. I gave you. We had it spare from the Royal Mint. You can either keep it or maybe use it for a giveaway prize. I heard my name. Yeah, that's oh, the one with comes, my name on. Honestly. So Ellie, Ellie has joined us. She's heard her name. Please be careful not to knock I them off their uh, chicken wing. Thank you. Um, blah, blah, blah. We had it spare from the Royal Mint. You can either keep it or maybe use it for a giveaway or if you want or give it to Ellie if she doesn't have one. <laughs> this know. coin is a thank you for everything you have done for us and just for entertaining us all the time. P.S. My mum and dad say hello. Oh, well, hello, Craig and, yes. uh, and, Mrs. and Mrs. Burton. Yeah, Mrs. Burton. We haven't had the pleasure of meeting no. Mrs. Burton, so hello. And that is from Alana. So some beautiful handwriting. It's yeah. far far neater than mine. And let's see right. let's see what it is. I want to carefully remove... So I think we'll decide yeah, what it is okay. before we decide if we're giving it to Ellie. Oh, or not. How did how did you know we were... Are you watching us, Lee? I heard my name through the door. All oh, right. It's oh. very loud, you see. A very kind gift. Hello, twisted fruitcake. <gasps> oh wow, we, wow, wow, oh, we. That is that is indeed a, ki a kind a gift. Very so, very kind gift. So that is a spare megalosaurus. Is it going to? I wonder why it's not uh, focusing, lady. Um, is it because Hello. it's set up as a webcam? I am not sure. It did all right can we see? Week, can, can we see it better there? Does that focus better? No, I don't think it does. Oh, so Craig's watching as well. All right. Hello, Craig. We are zoomed in, aren't we? Right, so it is a Megalosaurus Strike Your Own. So is this, is this when we met you, Alana? Awesome. Did we did we meet you for this Strike Your Own? I can't remember which Strike Your Own it was that we did. So that is very, very kind of you. Yeah, yeah that's Don't touch it. Don't touch it, Bungle. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's a, that is a direct instruction, isn't it? So Alana has sent us it, so there's no yeah. way I would go against what... No what Alana's telling us yeah what a shame about that focus if I just hold it I just hold it and look cool it's focused on your thumb freeze yeah no <laughs> didn't do it <laughs> coin patrol is saying open it and touch it yeah no because no, well, Alana did it yep so we, we have one of these Lady M don't we have one of these each so we do. quite happy to give this to, uh, to Ellie yep well done Ellie thanks Ellie likes dinosaurs. She does like dinosaurs and free stuff. Ellie yeah. loves dinosaurs. So Ellie gets a free coin for doing absolutely yeah. bottle. Right, so That's I'm gonna stick that back down you. so we can uh, keep the little sticker. Ah, nice. I'll there let you, you say thank you to Alana. Thanks. Thank very much. Right, we've got a postcard next. So wake me up, make things happen. And we've got an amazing, an amazing emoji there in the top right hand corner. Let's see. Oh, hang on. We might again. It might say something rude, might miss. I better give it, it a quick it, scan. It doesn't. I've already read it. I've had a quick look Have just you? to make sure. Oh, it's to you. No. Oh, it's to you. This is for Lady M. Okay. Right. Thanks, so, I'll see you. Up, make things happen. As so it says. Go on. Leave, leave, leave us two this one, and then we don't. We don't need a third third oh. one for this one. Thank you. If we I need you, we'll shout you. Alana, bye. Bye bye. Ellie said thanks again, Alana. It's very kind. So. What's that say? Sorry, your. Sorry, your Majesty. The stamps upside oh, down. Oh isn't that? Uh, isn't that? I'm, I'm sure. Isn't that like Trago? Look, isn't that treason or something like that? They were to put the coin. <laughs> that they put the coin. Put the Queen. The Queen's vagina upside down. I'm sure it is. So Patrick Woods will be getting into uh, into some serious trouble for that. I hope we oh, don't. No, I hope we don't get into trouble for it. I'm sure we won't. So, it's, it's nice Hello, Robin. And, uh, Hello, the, Edward. There's the PO box address. So it says, when you see someone without a smile,
give them one of yours. Patrick Woods, aged 51 and three quarters. <laughs> oh, thanks, Patrick. Great. Bit of an Adrian Mole there. Yeah, definitely. Oh, so you must think my smiles are worth passing round. How and lovely. Andrew W. saying he's sure it is. Trev saying, off, off, with, it, off with your head. <laughs> it's okay, Patrick. I'll protect you. Nice. That's Let's have lovely. a look at the other side. Yep. Did you check the time before that remark? No, Regina means queen. It's um, what what is it round round the, the in, in, inscription? Uh, queen Elizabeth, by the grace of God, queen and defender of the faith. <laughs> Regina means queen. Yeah, he said Regina. So wake up, make things happen. Amazing. Oh, well, thank you very much. So S E S Toast is saying correct. It is. It is. Is that illegal to put a stamp upside? Put a stump, a stump upside, upside down. down. Yeah. Yeah. Don't get your stumps upside down. Either. I did say Regina. I definitely did. It must oh, just I did. be. It must just yeah. be my accent. Hello, Judas. Hello, yeah. Grossy. Regina doesn't sound right. Okay, you've got to go to bed now, Alana. <laughs> Come on, right, good night, your, da- Alana. Your, da- your dad said, "Promise your daddy be away for nine. Yeah. Go on, off you pop. Thank you. Ellie's over the moon. We're great. Yes. Andrew W keeps hearing it wrong. Don't know why. Regina, <laughs> Queen's Regina. R- 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 right, we've got this one. Like on Christopher's uh, live stream just now, it was the r. Right, little one. Cute. Standard first class stamp. It's got to be my turn, Lady M. I'll let Lovely. you keep. I'll let you keep an eye on the comments. Okay. While I uh, give this a bash. Ooh. Is anybody? Is anybody excited? So yes. Touche McBouche is special little pineapple. Apparently her mum calls me Touche and I ask you both to pick I and I ask you to both pick my YouTube name, Special Little Pineapple or Touche. Definitely Touche. Touche McBouche. Yeah. Without definitely. a doubt. Or or Touche McBouche Pineapple. Com- combine the two. <laughs> ah right, so this I'm sure this is a trade. So Bungle and Lady M, many thanks for everything you have done. Alan Robinson, keep up the good videos. I love watching them. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, Alan. Brilliant handwriting. I've got I've got the remark on the handwriting. Not only is it neat and looks posh, I can read it as well. So I'm, uh, I'm well pleased with that. With nice. that. Uh, yeah, and this was a trade. So we did a... Uh, oh, we're well, fighting with the camera, aren't we? So we did a trade. I sent... I like volleyball, I think. I'm sure I did a volleyball <laughs> for hockey, and I don't, uh, I don't have many hockeys. Yeah, I need, uh, I definitely need some technical because the it was working before the the, the Zoom, wasn't it? We had, oh, we had to go into a corner, I think. Did we? Have, no, no, was that the no. week before? No, Look it, was at all, that. it was all fine, wasn't it? Last week, I don't know why. Yeah, it's that suddenly... is that is rubbish, isn't it? I wonder if it's because further away. Well, no, but it's not further away when I do that. <laughs> Is it? It's not on screen when you do that either. Well, you know what I, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah. If tech guy happens to be watching, come down and tell me why. Yeah. Why my focus is all of a sudden gone? Because it is. Uh, it is distressing me. Yeah. There we go. That's probably about the best bet. So we did a we did a trade. Right. Good night, Alana. Smashing. Off you go. That's it. Final call, Alana. Head to bed. Don't trust Bungle with sharp implements, says Smithy. Definitely not. Uh, Alan Newton is asking if you cleaned your 2011 shield. No. No, I haven't. No, that's straight in the date run. I did not do anything with it. <laughs> Edward Pugh is saying, I feel so honoured when I see the Queen's Regina. <laughs> <laughs> right. This is an international package. So this has got New Zealand Post written on it. Small air parcel. Cost 18 and a half, I assume, New Zealand dollars. James is saying don't get your boosh and your vagina mixed up. Boosh. It's good that name, boosh. I like boof as well. Boof. <laughs> so we've got a coin set, a historic coin set Ooh. from New Zealand. That sounds good. Uh, I'll own this one, Lady M. Yes, it's definitely Regina Aviation Media. Media. R- 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 r. Mm. We maybe need to stop saying it. Yeah, no, I won't. <laughs> no, that's it now. I've done. What, what, what more is there to say? How about the scissors? 
Yeah, that's the one thing about doing this live. I can edit out all my bungles when it comes to <laughs> bungling trying to open packages. It's because I like to save the packaging as well, you see. If I can reuse it, I will. Ooh, Robin GW, where are you going? That only takes three minutes. Ooh, wow. Robin's about 14 as well. Have I way. got something? What? James B. Hoy's asking, at Lady M, have you got something written on your right thigh, my coin tuber crush? What? Honestly, you are crackers. Right, that's address. This is a letter. I don't have any tattoos or markings of any description on any thighs. Right. Here we go. Let's leave Lady M's thighs. <laughs> Do it. 28th of July 2020. So we've had this uh, We've had this a little while. I've been in transit a little while. A while. To a bungalow, Lady M. Kiora. Not sure. Does anybody know what this word says? I don't know. Kiora. I only know that because it used to be on the orange juice. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Don't know. Mm. Maori. 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 Mm. Oh, ma yeah. Maori. Is there anything Maori. to do with um, Moana? Mm. Is it on Moana? If it was on Moana, I might know what it is. Anyway, <laughs> meaning have life or be healthy, but used to say hi, used to say hi or hello in New Zealand. So, <laughs> hello. Uh, yeah, no, Jamesy. I'm definitely. I'm just looking down at the table, not my thighs. <laughs> I'm writing to say a big thank you to to you both for all the time spending producing your YouTube videos and for the entertainment it provides. Enclosed is a little something you noted you wanted after obtaining the 1970 annual set to say to say thanks. Wow. Being on the other side of the world and with the current issues connected with travel, we were unable to travel to the UK this year and therefore unable to enjoy my favourite passion of 50p and two pound hunts. Every morning I start my day watching coin tuber videos and that watching other people so passionate about coins helps keep the drive alive for me. Okay. Keep up the A to Z series. I enjoy viewing the different places around the UK. Yeah, thank you. Um, please do give the A to Z adventures some love. Every Wednesday we upload a new letter. We go all the way around the country and uh, see the sites that are on the A to Z 10 P's. We hardly get any views for that really co uh, um, in comparison, other than the one that where Half Asleep Chris did a cameo where it's 4,000 views. So other than that one, we didn't. Especially last Wednesday is the one we uploaded last Wednesday, the, the Tower of London. So if, if anyone wants to watch anything, please go and watch the Tower of London and give that one some, some likes. But yeah, we, we love the A to Z series, don't it we? It is Maori. I, Maori. Yeah, native New Zealand. All oh, right, yeah, Maori. It is in uh, yeah. Moana, isn't it? Or is it Maui? No, I'm thinking That's the Maui. Maui. Maui messing around. Anyway, I also like the speedy 50p hunts, so keep those up too. Yeah, I've done that. Did that as a little bit of something a bit different. I'm sure we will do that again at some point. I am fortunate to have all three of the 50p's issued, all but three of the 50p's issued since 1970, including two of the Holy Grail from 2009. That's good going. Mm -hmm. I cannot wait to return to the hunt as soon as time permits and to continue the hunts for two pound coins. I congratulate you for reaching 2,000 subscribers, so well done for, for the goals, and may numbers continue to rise rapidly. So if anyone's watching and not subscribed, please subscribe, because Stephen Patrick said that you have to. All right. Don't forget to like the stream as well, everyone. Don't forget to like, I, I forget to say that. I hope during the next trip to the UK to visit the Mint and hopefully catch up with one or two of the coin tubers. I wish you all the best, keep safe, keep well, Oh no. Keep well and keep safe to you and all your followers. Regards, Stephen Patrick and on you mister, he is Kiwi19. Oh. So this is uh, this is interesting. This is really, really cool. So thank you in advance for that, Stephen. Tappy Coins is saying she's half or whoever sorry, he or she is half expecting you to do a video of smashing up coins with a hammer. 1989 UK proof set. Right. Oh, this is not the 19. This is not the 1989 proof set. This is indeed the um, the first set of decimal coins. I can tell by the packaging on the outside. Ooh. It looks in good nick as well. Bubble wrap and everything. Oh, flipping X, Stephen. This is, uh, I am very, very, very excited. So we did a we did a trade with DC Coin World, who's a, a, a coin channel over. Oh, nearly got you. 
a coin channel I'm over in the US. Very poor for my and he sent me the 1971 proof set. It was in pieces, of course. It was in bits. So I was quite happy to, to handle them. And I was saying I would love the set. Oh, wow. Um, but the first pre decimals. And right. this is looking like the. Just no well, it'll probably be in a plastic case. Right. It, look, it looks the business because it used to come in these like envelopes. Oh, so wow. we've got the United Kingdom adopted a decimal coinage system on the fifteenth of February, nineteen seventy-one. Do you know they did it in a couple of days as well? They shut the they shut the banks on the Friday and then over the weekend, opened up on the fifteenth wow. and they converted everything from from pre decimal to decimal. Cool. That is impressive. Royal Mint told me that's written on the wall. The proof set contains some of the first example of these coins. Wow. What's it say on the other side of the box? Oh. The decimal coin is your Great Britain and Northern Ireland. Wow. So this is the UK's. Because it's the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. This is this is exciting times, oh, this. Yeah. Look at that, it is as well. Wow, we Look at that, that is awesome. That really is awesome. How cool is the colour inside there as well? I like yeah. that. Like a rose there we gold, go. coppery kind of. The first thing that Very strikes posh. me is how few they are. Edward Pugh is saying, can we do a swap? So, of course. Oh, thanks, Lisa. Uh, welcome uh, welcome to... Thank you for becoming a member of the channel. Oh, there's there, there's my face there. Look, Ooh. you get to see me <laughs> do, twice. Do, there we go. <laughs> Double bungles. So, the first thing that strikes me on this is the fact there's so few coins in it. Of course, there's no £2 coin. There's, yeah. no, there's, no, there's no pound. No. So, there's no 20 pence. That didn't come out till eighty two, I think it was. Oh, right, okay. And of course, it's all the big fat, uh, the big fat coins as well. Awesome. That is absolutely. Oh, look at I've, 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 I've got my hands have gone all sweaty. <laughs> Sorry. So look at that. There's the obverse, nineteen seventy one. Patrick Woods is asking, what's the square coin? This, that's the token. So that's the the token that the Royal Mint put in. So it's got the. Have a look. See if we can. What can we do with the focus? It was focusing better Pro probably, further away. Probably not a lot. No, that's not bad. I'll just see whether if I just come back out again. No. No, hello. Let me just see whether a wider angle helps it. Probably getting a bit of lag, aren't we? Is that I'm any sure. better? Yeah, and it's got a half pence in. No, the lag's absolutely confused the life out of me as well. No, anyway, I so this token, really nice. so you're not going, you're not going to be able to see it. So this token, so it's got all the, it's got all the crests of all the parts of the UK. In. I'll zoom back in again. So it's got, it has two Englands, and that's because Wales is part of the Kingdom of England apparently. Yeah, you're not going to be able to see it now. That the lag's, uh, the lag's blowing my mind. Tech guys probably on the internet. Get off the internet. If you're honest, no, you're not going to be able to see it, unfortunately. But anyway, I'll point it out anyway. So we've got the we've got the Irish harp here, we've got the two, the the, the two parts of uh, of England, and then Scotland's in that corner. So it's the token that the Royal Mint puts in. So there there is indeed the mint. That's the, that's the mint mark of the Royal Mint, and you're not going to be you're not going to be able to see it. So I'm not sure. I think that's like a Tudor rose or something like that. But yeah, I'm sorry that you can't uh, you can't see that very well. It's focusing on the background. That's why. Oh, is it? Right. Mm -hmm. on, let's get rid of the white and see whether the white makes any difference. I'm sweating now. <laughs> yeah, I, I literally come out in a sweat. Right, is this any better? Let's see. Give it a moment. No, I don't think it is, is it? I'm trying. Oh, it's focuses on the. It's see probably the... too shiny, that now. Possibly. Is that what it is? Principality of England, Richard. I'm oh, sure no. Richard's from Wales as well, so you will know. Taffy coins are somewhere, definitely part, not part of the Kingdom of England. Something like that. Is it print? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. I'm not being uh, disrespectful to anybody there. I just know it's not that you, unfortunately, you just don't have your own your own thing, whatever it be, a leak or a daffodil or something. So, <laughs> Christopher's saying your reflection is very clear. Yes, it is, isn't it? So anyway, some of them. So yes, so there's no twenty pence. That was eighty two. There's no pound coin. Eighty three. Was it the pound coin? Eighty three. No two pound coin. Uh, eighty six will be. I think the first one for eighty six was the first two pound coin. The, the the single metal. 
So we've got the big we've got the big boy ten pence, the big boy five pence, the big boy fifty p, the the standard penny that we obviously recognise with the port port colours on there, the standard two uh, two pence, and then we've got the half penny which I think went out eighty eighty three hour circulation, and then eighty four it was only available in the in uh, in the, the last bunk pack for that year. A little bit of toning on there, but that's uh, to be expected I guess over time, and I just think it adds a little bit of extra. A little bit of extra jazz to it. Here's a fun fact. I've said this a few times. So the reason why the two pound, the two pound, two pounds even. Where's me? Where's me through? I'll, I'll have to do my point. I have to use a premium point now. So the reason why the two pence is this big. So it's a little bit, a little bit disproportionate. The two pence, especially when you compare it even to the five p, which is, uh, is small. Even the big boy is smaller than that. So the reason why the two pence is as large as it is, it's to do with weight. So the two pence is exactly twice the weight of a penny and the penny is exactly twice the weight of the half pence. So you've got the half pence weight, double it, you get the penny, double it, you get the two pence. And that was designed, it was all done with pre-decimal, it was all designed for banking. So you could stick all your coppers in a, in a, in a bag and weigh into the bank and it would be, be by weight. So I know you're not supposed to mix the coins, it says on the bank bags now, but that was the idea. You just shut your copper in a bag and you'd know how much it was in by weight, uh, by the weight and then dividing it. And you would know what the mintage was. Mm -hmm. uh, the blah, 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 what the uh, how much was physically there. So I'm I'm blown away there, Stephen. I really am. Awesome. Thank you so much. Beautiful. Yeah. Everybody was agreeing how lovely it was. Yeah, it really is. I know I might Lin be. Lindy Nairn said so. They are NIFCs, are they? Or did they? Did that one go no, into circulation? No, no, year? no, no. The, the, there's no NIFCs. They all this the first year decimalisation, so they all came out. Yeah. It's 1972 s that are the the following year that's NIFC oh, right. uh, for the for for the coins or for I don't know how many exactly, but certainly the penny and the the two pence. Laughter is saying same with the two times five p and the ten p. Right? Never is it really? Oh, I didn't know that. I wonder if it's the same. Is it the same with the modern? No, I can't. With the five, surely it's not. Maybe it's a yeah, bit bigger. Yeah, five's tiny, isn't it? Yeah, but the, the big 10p doesn't look looks more than twice the size of a 5p. I shall maybe test it one day. Yeah, so it's left to saying that the, the five pen, double the five pence in weight and you get yeah. the 10p. Yeah, it's clever, isn't it? Yeah, brilliant. Oh, well, thank you. And I'm sorry if I went on a bit there, everybody. Absolutely lovely. But that is absolutely beautiful, fantastic. It really is. And to come all the way from New Zealand as well, oh. I'm, uh, I'm really touched with that. Yeah. Thank you, and I think it's worth a like. It's worth a like in the in the stream. So if you if you're watching on your phone, just X out the chat behind it. Your thumbs up and thumbs down appears. Give us a thumbs up because that is definitely worth it. I'm I'm blown away with that. I really am. I'm actually yeah. I've actually got a sweat on. A proper sweat on. Where can we put that for the minute? Careful. Let's stick that there. You're gonna stay there. Hopefully, don't want to bungle it. Thank you so much, Steve and Patrick. Oh. Absolutely. So I don't know how many more times I could say amazing. Left is saying an old five pence weighs 5.65 grams and an old 10 pence weighs 11.3 grams. So, yeah, that would not work out. You're just guessing that, Lydia. I don't believe that yeah, you've no, just I doubled that in your head. It is, yeah. Right. I can do maths. <sighs> That's maths GCSE. Right, next. Right. Do you want to do the next one, Lady M? Can do. Oh, there we go. Give me a hard one. Where it's. Uh, well, like, do you want a different one? Thoroughly wrapped. No, it's okay. Oh, I well. Found a, you were the uh, you found were the expert, the, the cutting open expert. I found an entrance. <sighs> Sweat on. Yeah, no, I'll Hello, sad man. Don't worry. Thank you very much for coming. Have you missed anything? We've been opening up the stuff that was sent to our PO box. Don't forget, we need to uh, just check the uh, check for evidence. Then yeah. hide the details. Okay. Hello, coin collecting Ella. Thanks for joining us. Yes, Matt, amazingly kind. He really was. Lisa Don't loves the half pennies. So cute. Oh, right. I'll let you have a fiddle with that while I uh, check have this. A, have a fiddle with that. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, yeah. Yeah. Looks like it's the is it green on the inside like the felt of a pool table ah, or something like that. RJ coins. Ah right, okay. Any anything yeah, there? No, it's fine. Am you I the reader that? out? Right? You read the reader out. RJ coins. You've got lovely handwriting as well. It's a little bit hard for me to read, but still lovely. 
So let's see what Richard's got to say. Bungalow Lady M, thank you for your generous assistance to help me in my trade with Rob. You're welcome. An act like that is why you are so well liked and respected by the coin community. You really didn't need to uh, to send any, Richard. In fact, I told you deliberately not to send anything. Mm -hmm. um, as much as you asked for nothing in return, I couldn't let that be the case. I hope you enjoy another piece of Australian colour that is enclosed. Mm -hmm. Thank you again, my friends. Cheers, Richard from wow, RJ Coins. Look at that. Ooh, is it a two dollar? Look at that beauty. Wow, we women's T Twenty World Cup two dollars. That's awesome. 2020 as well so again i think because of the i think because of the lack of i think because of the lack of focus you're not necessarily going to be mm. able to see that unfortunately what about would maybe up to the other camera i can try well i can but we, we we got rid of the camera that i'm now trying to do a close-up because of, of its crap focus so i don't <laughs> understand poor focus dear poor sorry focus. it's poor focus <laughs> so i don't know why it's not playing ball. Tech guy clearly isn't watching to come and help me. I, do you know what? I think it might be too bright. No, it's not. Anyway, take my word for it. It's an absolutely fantastic $2 coin. Colour around the outside. Maybe take a picture and put it on there. Oh, you can. It's alright for you saying that, isn't it? I, do all, I have to do all the social medias. Making suggestions. Yeah, giving give, give, give me more work by the sounds of it. <laughs> All right for you. Anyway, that is a lovely, lovely coin. It's yes. amazing that the the, you, um, that the uh, Aussies put colour on the coin. I'm sure the circulate as well. The you, you can get them. Well, you can. You can get them in circulation. Coloured coins or coloured coloured little um, do for dangler on it. Lovely. Macamula saying the 50p was only in the proof set, so it's an NIFC, right? Okay. Right. Oh, I need it. I need it. I'll need it then for me. No. I no, I'm not. I'm just sending a little. <laughs> Let me just have a look at that. Just out of interest. <clears throat> Easy noise. Honestly, he's right. Everyone, everyone's always right. Honest. I do need a 1971 big 50 pens. Well, I also need a 72, a 74, and a 75. And an 84, and an 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, and 91. So it's... And a 92, a 93, a 94, 95, and 96. And I wonder whether I could break I could break that out of that proof set. I'll have to think about that. So yeah, 1971 is indeed at NIFC. Thank you, Macamula. Yeah, don't you dare. Stephen Keeley coins saying it's a belter. Yeah, I think everyone agrees it's there. Yeah. Oh, there is RJ coins. Thank you, Richard. Honestly, yes. really, you really didn't need to send anything. I wanted to. Um, well, you know the drill. Thank you. Stunning. Oh, Touche McBoosh is now Touche McBoosh Pineapple. <laughs> For a second there, he thought it was the top of a TV set. Mm. More coins should be in collar. Yeah, I agree, Nick. SES Toast, touch that coin and I will make sure you know it. <laughs> Ooh. Don't you be dare, told. Bungle. No, I won't, Amber, don't worry. Be told. Lindsay Nairn's asking back and Moolah about the 5Ps and the 10Ps. Right. Send me the date of the chunky 50Ps you need. I have a few spare. We'll check what I have. Oh, nice one. Yep, yeah, okay. We'll definitely, but obviously we'll have to come up with some kind of tray for that, Richard, yeah? I think I, need, I basically need every single one, <laughs> uh, <laughs> apart from 2009 and 2011. Yeah, I need every single one. <laughs> that makes it easy for you. Right. All the others are circulated, apparently. Should we move on? Oh, here we are. Hang on, let me just do oh. strike 777. Yep, we had coloured coins since 2012, on and off, as circulated and in our NIFC. They are stunning, the Australian coins. I, I love... Um, I'm not into world coins per se, but I do love world coins with the Queen on. I do. Yeah. Um, particular favourite is the... Oh, um, is it 25 cents? The, the, the Canadian beaver... Uh, I am a massive fan of that of, of Beaver um, because obviously it's got the it's got the Queen on, so I like I like that one. I also quite like the Schooner as well, the the Canadian Schooner. Um, anything from the Cayman Islands because I didn't have a Cayman Islands coin up until recently, uh, and any anything with the Queen on really. Yeah, I think we found one from the Falkland Islands, didn't we as well? That was cool with the fox on. 
the Faultman's Fox, yeah, and 50p's. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and of course, you've got loads of 10, 10p's with loads on there, so. Paul Charlotte, just saying we all love Bieber. Yeah. Anyway, so right. right, let's do let's just, let's just halt the proceedings for so this was this was an investment. So I was saying last week on uh, on Bungle After Dark last Sunday that I think it is worth and I'll have to have the evidence here. I think it's worth investing in twenty twenty fifty P coins or in fact any twenty twenty really that's not a pound or a, or a penny. I think it's worth investing in the fifty P in particular because after we went to the Royal Mint our tour guide said that she doesn't think that any more, any 2020 coins will go into circulation. So that includes the 50p. So currently, so I paid, I paid a bit more than I wanted to of these really, including postage. But I paid £9.50 each for these. And providing the Royal Mint doesn't circulate any 50p's. No, in fact, I'm just going to take them off here because I don't want to. What's that smell? It's not me. It must be something from outside. In there. Oh no, it's out of here. I was just going to ask you, have you taken your shoes off? No, it, it, it's a. Uh, it must be the smell of. Oh, bu- is it out of there? It's the smell of bunk. Like, it's, it's bunk it's smell. Like, it smells like sweaty feet. It smells like bunk. <laughs> so a big thanks to Grossy oh. Coin Hunt, who, uh, who who found this for me because I, <laughs> I I made a bit of a mistake. I told everybody on the live stream last week to go and buy some twenty twenty fifty p's as an investment. And of course, I hadn't bought mine, so it went up. The first one I got a few weeks ago was, I think I paid £8.50, including postage. And obviously now, they're, uh, they've gone up a little bit. Yeah, it does stink, that, doesn't it? Yeah. So, grossy thanks for everything, apart from a stinking... Getting them from a stinking uh, sauce. Coins to a collect, just saying. She said they had only recently minted oh, some 1p coins as well, yeah. Yeah, 1p's and pounds, one P's wasn't and it? 1p's and pounds, yeah. So... Hopefully, these will still be in their plastic prison. Hello, Jerry. And they are indeed. So, I'll get them all out first. So, £9.50. I bought five. These are just going to be put away for best. And if the Royal Mint doesn't mint any, then I think they'll straight away, they'll be 20 quid, and it won't be long before the 40 quid. And up over. Who knows? I mean, some someone was telling me, the grossly, I think, was telling me that the... There was a 2016 shield that went for, for 160 quid recently. So these are, there's plenty around on eBay, and, be, and that's because people are buying the annual set of the Royal Mint and cutting out the Team GB, selling that separately for 30 to 40 is pound. What, is that where they've, are they've come out yeah. of it? Is that why yeah. they look like that? Yeah, right. so they've just okay. been cut out. So people are then selling on yeah, the coins. Yeah, it's okay, that, Amber, he's going to keep them in the plastic. Yes, I am. These are an investment, Amber. £9.50 a piece. And if they don't mint any, I say I think it'll it'll treble and double and quadruple in size or whatever very quickly. And if they do mint some, then I've probably lost nine quid a piece. Oh my word, so. Emily Arts, super chat four ninety nine. Thank you, Emily. That is very generous of you. Hi, yeah. Bungle and Lady M. I hope you are both doing okay. Yeah, we're really good. We are. Now. We are now. Especially now. <laughs> Thank you. Hi. You should become a member. You, you're very kind, Emily. I'm, I'm sure you um, you donated last week and the week before. You should become a member. It's only ninety nine pence a month, and uh, you then get entered into the monthly yeah. members prize draw as well. Stand a chance of winning. Yeah, you know you could have had four, four, five months membership there for that. Not that being ungrateful at all. I'm just I just like value. Yeah. You know, so yeah, you should do that, Emily, if you if you if you're able to. Yeah, two thousand sixteen is the only one needs Paul Shard. Yeah. How much did they go for, Paul on eBay? I'm sure it was gross. He said they went for a hundred. There's one went for 160 recently. I'd love to find one in a in a coin hunt. I really would, mm-hmm. just to finish my uh, date runner course, which badly needs something. Seriously, Mark, you? Oh yeah, we're just going to put them away for bed. Put them away and forget about them, and hopefully, yeah. they will become a cool investment. Paul shot 120 to 160. Wow. Yeah, it's a lot of money, isn't it, for for a shield when the, the annual set will have been. Uh, how much is the annual set just for the definitive coins? Is it 30 quid? 25? Somewhere between 20 and 30 quid, I'm sure, for the, for the ant, just for the definitives. And if you get the ones with the commemorative in as well, maybe 60 pounds. So, yeah, whoever did that is uh, quids in. Whoever called the 2016 uh, NIFC shield. Right, do you want to open this or me? Whose turn is it? 
Uh, I think it's your turn, is it? Oh, well, I opened the last one, but that was my oh. own parcel, wasn't okay. it? So. Yeah, oh, hello, Carl. Thank you very much for joining. Really, really appreciate it. Oh, yeah. Do, do you use your, uh, your new emojis to, to tell us who your favourite coin tuber is out of the pair of us? <laughs> and don't worry, I only take it personal when people say it's Lady M. <laughs> All right, yeah, you can concentrate on what I do. Yeah. Oh. oh, flipping heck. Oh, Richard Harmon. Oh, my word, there's some stuff in here. Ooh. Oh, I tell you what, there's some amazing stuff in here. Ooh. Oh, it's stickers. Ooh, my <laughs> oh, oh, look at that. Oh, that, my word, they're awesome. That is absolutely class. Whoever this was, oh. I love you. Yeah. Right. Oh, there, well, there's the clue. Yeah. There's the clue. Wowzers. Right. It's from Coin Patrol. Hi, Bungle oh. and Lady M. I hope you're well. Here are a few self-adhesive stickers. I hope you, I hope there's some you like. All the best, Paul from Coin Patrol. And uh, yeah, you can subscribe to Paul on, and Coin well Paul slash Coin Patrol on YouTube. He is one cool dude. You uh, are jealous. Why? Why is there a load of uh, <laughs> Why is there a load of emojis for you in the chat? Um, no, I said favorite coin tuber. Oh, favorite. Yeah, Has yeah, Kyle maybe, done it? Maybe they got confused. Ah, there we go. It's Taffy Coins. Taffy Coins. By the way, this is my main account, and he's put a bungle. So well Aww. done, Kyle. Oh, well done. Smashing. So I'd said to Paul um, about getting some stickers to go on the two pound. Yeah, so we stick a little sticker bungle collects. What did Christopher call us? Boogle, boogle, bongle, bongle oh, collects. Oh, I like that one. I can't quite remember what he called us. Bing, not bingle. Oh, thanks, Katie. Boggle, Jones. boogle, don't know. But anyway, so we've got some stickers that were put on the two pound coins that you can find in your change. And I, and I, I was saying this to Coin Patrol, and he's obviously gone bananas and sent an absolute shed load of stickers. Yeah, so, class. who's this guy? Don't who's know. this guy? Never heard don't, know. don't know. Some funny looking dude. That's better. So was it, yeah, we'll have to we'll zoom, we'll zoom out look so we can we can we can see them all. I'm only kidding, Christopher. Look, there we oh, go. Oh wow, look at that. Yeah, there's the Welsh dragon. Yeah, I like the Bambi as well. It's a little bit well, it's not very macho, isn't it, the Bambi? Oh, I like that one, Mr. V. So we'll have to go. Oh, Emily Art has become a super fan. Thank you, Ooh. Emily. Thank you very much. Yeah, that, you need to wear that one. Uncle needs to wear we'll that one. Have to one. go all the way around. It's the danger zone. Jerry had to change my chat name. Why oh. was that, Jerry? Why was that? Well, oh, thanks for the three yes, thirty-three. That is very kind. Very and again, kind. it's cheaper to become a member. You know, ninety-nine pence a month, and you're getting you're getting you get into an exclusive members-only prize draw. This is phenomenal. This, this is absolutely phenomenal. Oh, it's Harry Potter that one. Oh, is it? <laughs> Wow, we oh, I like that special edition oh, as well. You are definitely a special edition. You are. <laughs> oh, we've got everything. We've got Scott. We've got so. Oh. In fact, I'm just gonna have to go through. I'm gonna have to go through through all of these anyway. So we have got uh, the USA. Big fan of the USA. Big fan of that. Uh, Guinness. Uh, yeah, I drink Guinness. Yeah, you so recently discovered that, haven't you? I did. Yeah, when, when I went to Dublin last year for my uh, thir thirtieth birthday. Is definitely for you. Caution. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That, yeah, that is what warning, warning yeah. bungle after dark. I think that one. <laughs> We've got the fabulous coin patrol. Amazing, absolutely amazing. Hi, Paul Dodge. In fact, cut your ears. Oh, is this? Jerry's uh, put a dragon on. He wasn't. Jerry's put a dragon on. A dragon on it. I am a member. He's put a dragon on the end, like a dragon emoji. Yeah, it might just be put something in the, in the thingy. Don't know. Yeah, you can see the logo next to me. Yeah, you can still put emojis in, but you also so you'll be able to Jerry. You can see the Bungle Collects logo next to him. You can also put your favourite uh, Bungle <laughs> Collects coin tuber emoji as well. So Scotland, we've got the Union flag. We've got stop before you touch the coins. Yes. I'm not sure about this one. I'm not. Uh, oh, do, hello Kitty's cute. That does not. That does nothing for me. Oh, I don't no think. Hello, There's it. We've got a duplicate, so we've got another yeah. another Bungle. I'm a big fan of Superman. Yeah. So yeah, really, 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 really appreciate that one. 
we could, we're just running out of space, aren't we? Have we, got, have we got some space? Have we got a bit of space down here? Look, mm-hmm. there's Superman. Batman, yeah, oh, like Batman. Batman ones, not, yeah. as, not as much as, as Superman. Oh, yeah, there is another Batman. Oh, there's Jerry. He's got his, oh, used his logo. Batman Very there. good. Smashing Private. I like it. There's another <coughs> Scotland. We've got a couple of England, a couple of duplicate Englands there. We've got Fosters. Yeah, Fosters. I don't mind it. Don't mind the odd lager. I'm not a big drinker. Oh, well, I don't mind drinking. I just can't handle many. So there's the Union flag. We should put them got on a Mr. There. Bean. Any of the coins that you shouldn't touch, keep out. Yeah. What's this one here? Oh, that's a Hello Kitty I was covering up, wasn't yeah. I? Where are we? Where are we for space? Oh, I've got oh, a little bit few down here. Look. So these are absolutely amazing. Awesome. I do, I do like, I do like these stickers. Thank yeah. you very much. They are cool as. Loving them. Stop. Smashing privates sounds painful. There's uh, there's tra- there's tragedies. <laughs> yeah, miss it. That is brilliant. I wonder how did he end up with it with all these, Paul? So is that comedy then? Oh, it could be. I've got a duplicate. Look, need a double up. It's like that game, isn't it? Where you turn over the over the cards and then mm. see where you can find your that me and you, partner. Ying and Yang. No, we 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 like this. Yeah, Ying right and Yang. All right, that's what I think it means opposites. Ying and Yang. Well, we are quite opposite, but we work together well. Well. Now I'm better looking. <laughs> and younger, apparently. <laughs> yeah, well, I'll just say when I went when I went to Dublin last year for my thirtieth birthday. For your 30th. I um <laughs> I drank my first first pint of Guinness and yeah. it's uh, it's really nice. Yeah. It is over there anyway. It's much better over there than it is out the can. Chris Rawcliffe, hello. Yes, we're both fine. Thank you. Amber's calling me a lightweight. Yeah, Thank you. he is. We both are though. Will Collects, hello, thanks for joining us, Will. We're just going through our P.O. box. So if someone sent something in our P.O. box, um, everything up till a week yesterday, then we are opening it live. Right. David Scholes doesn't understand the concept of stickers. Where do you put them? Or wherever you want, that's the idea. You stick oh. them wherever you want. Won't you? So I'm going to stick, I'm going to stick one on my, on my ideas board. So. Like that. What's that say? Over your mouth. Just, it's just big enough to go oh. over your mouth, that's all. Right, I want to stick one on my ideas board. So my okay. ideas board, I've got obviously future ideas for the channel. Do you notice I put the Mickey Mouse up on the top there? Look. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, we'll you where that have gone. And then we've got our new Califax. Uh, yeah, I've got my Califax fridge magnet and my Bungle there. fridge magnet. And I want to stick a sticker on. That beetle just got a fang of them beetles on the kitchen wall. I think I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to put the I'm going to put on the, the logo on. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to put the logo on the ideas board. I'm putting it up there now. Uh, well, where are you going to bring? I don't know where do you want to put it. Well, I want to put it in the top right, but move okay, the right. pen I'll, down. I'll let you do it then. Yeah, I'm gonna just sort of just bear with me a minute, Lady M. We'll keep you entertained. Yeah. Go, Lady M. <laughs> go, 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 go. Right, I'll start. Uh... Oh no, 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 no! What? What? Don't, don't, I don't want to put them away. Oh, honestly. Let me just stick that on there. I like that one. Obviously, you tell me that does not, does not look the absolute business that. That does look the business. Doesn't it? That Doesn't absolutely that look good? does. Yeah. That's that awesome. really good. I like uh, Coinshuber yeah. merchandise as well. Yes. How many Coin Patrol stickers did we get? Oh, just one. What did we do? Mind you, it means we've got, we, we've we've got, got, we've got we found our other ones, didn't we? Yeah, we found them. Yeah. We've definitely got some. Yeah. It means I can use that one. I just want to put it on me, on the geek shelf somewhere, maybe. I'll think about that. I think about where I can put the coin patrol one. Right, have we got it? What's the plum find? What is the plum find, Lady Ooh. M? <clears throat> Definitely not that one. <laughs> we'll cover that one up. Um, I think. Oh, there's a moth. There's it's a... not a moth. It's one of them beetles that I found this morning on the kitchen roll, just sat there looking at me. Yeah. The, the, we've got the door open in the Bungle oh. Collects Magic Studio, so our studio lights are attracting a whole range of creepy crawlies. Oh, oh yeah, there's a few, but look at all oh, these little ones. Stop it, right. No, um, I think I'm one with the Welsh Dragon. Oh, just because it's because of absolute no, coins, like is it? it? Is it? No. Yeah, yeah, right, oh. Uh, my favourite is, I do like the Bungle logo, I must admit it's a big chunky logo. I think I'm going to go Superman. Superman. What's everybody else's favourite? Anybody else got a... Anybody else got a favourite in there? Richard Harmon saying Ying Yang is the cha- is Chinese sign of perfect harmony. It's oh, Millie's in. Hello, Mrs. Beaver. Thank you so much for joining us. Oh, long time no see. 
euro coin coin roll hunting. Do we trade oh, on Discord or new Mr. No? Re- Neither. I shall release Harry Potter. Hello. Tom, Tom, can you tell tech guy that, that I need him? Can you ask him to come down, please? <laughs> Tom Scrafton saying, Fosters, it's a good call. <laughs> Dublin Port again, this is really nice. From Nix. Ringo, what's Ringo? Uh, I'm not sure. Should we say Batman? Keith saying Guinness. Judas is saying the Welsh flag. Hello, Millie. Will Collect saying the smiley face one. Round Union that Jack one. for Trev. That right. One. Welsh flag for Judas, obviously. Do you sell bungle tea mugs? Uh, no, don't Wayne, but Raftree does. Raftree.co.uk, they, they sell it. Oh, Tom, is he being antisocial? Oh, he's not on with him. Can you can you ring him or something? What's he doing? There? Oh no, of course you're not on with him because I'm on the internet. Yeah. I told him he wasn't allowed on. That was a test. That Tom, well done. <laughs> Checking he wasn't on with it. Can you message him or something? Yeah. Oh, the Beatle, the Lady M saw it's Ringo. Very good. Oh right. Very good. Uh, Lady yeah. M's just going to entertain you for a few minutes. Uh, by doing what exactly? I don't know. Honestly, you're the gobby one, right? I'm gonna, right? Everybody. Oh. So Andrew Green says he likes the Playboy Bunny. Yeah, yeah. Um, Kyle Duggan says the Welsh flag all the way. That's all right, Tom. He's gone upstairs and shouting him. Patrick Woods. Oh, my phone's gonna die. That's uh, that's why I'm looking down everybody because I've got my phone on the table. Phone on the table just so I can read the comments easier because my eyes fail me at this time of the evening. Uh, Keith Elric says it's got to be the Saint Andrew's flag. Um, Christopher collects got to be the plum find no way oh is it on too? no is it what, what? no it's live oh it's live uh, right. tech guy so, so, if, so if I check that let's take that as an example can you close the door for me so if you have a look look so this was perfect last week so we just get some technical support and then can you see there it's nowhere it's nowhere near can you see on the screen Oh yeah, how do you do that? Just focus locks on. Oh, oh. honestly. So oh no, it's staying on. Uh, you're just gonna have to. What, what press it again to get there? <laughs> no, right. So what, what? What did you press? I just tapped the screen near the coin. Do you know when you're in the camera app and you wanted to focus on something? Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh right. Change. Yeah. Well, I probably was doing that automatically last week, but it's higher up because we're doing the PO box. Yeah. Right. Right. Is that all I need to do? Yeah. Right. Thanks, tech guy. Super. So that is the, that is the swap. So we can show the we can we can show the coin now. Jeez. Thank you. Right. Do you want to pass me the bag? I'm not, are you going to put them in? Uh, no. I don't really want to put them away in the bag. Do you want to show the? Show that two pound coin then now now. What now. what on earth is going on? Big cup, we love Lady M. What is honestly? I dread to think what you lot are talking about on that uh, Discord. Lady M's got big cup. Is that what it is? <laughs> right, here we go then. There we go. That's the coin I was showing earlier. Oh that's better. There we go. Two dollars. Two Australian dollars, so in fact, can I zoom in? Oh. And then focus. Oh, there yes, we go. There we go. Yeah, that's a little bit better, isn't it? Uh, tech it's guy's only... a genius. Tech guy for the win. Tom Scrafton, yeah. It was as simple <laughs> as pressing the focus on the camera. <laughs> of course, because last week the camera was there, so I could see it. Yes. I would do that automatically. There we go. That Beatles back. The Beatle never went, Lady M. And there is the JC port rate on the 2020 Australian coin. You probably can't see it, but it is the JC is there on the shoulder down there. But no, I really can't close, focus in any further than that. Uh, what else was there anything else that we couldn't focus in on? Was there anything they're, else? They're all saying you have to change the name to Lady M Collects. <laughs> Fair enough. Lady M Collects. It's there in spirit. It's there in spirit. Right, was there anything? I felt as though there was something else I wanted to zoom in on. Right, we'll press on. We'll press on. So we've only got uh, four left, I think. Right, Lady M. You or me for this, this for this big boy. Thanks. Right. Okie dokie. All the talking in the set. 
you were going to focus in on that, weren't you? The what? The talking out of the set. Oh, yes. Yeah. Who Nicks. said that? Nix. All oh, right, yeah. Let's do or that Nitch. then. Nitch. Nitch. Let's Nitch. do that. Live so anybody now. who has left the chat yes. well done. is missing out. There we go. How was that? Just as well. You, oh, yeah, that's smashing now, is that isn't better? it? It's much better. So to get the premium cocktail stick. So there is the Royal Mint Mint Mark. So I think it's I think it's supposed to be the Tower of London. If it it's looks not the, like the Tower of London. If it's not the Tower of London, because that's where it originally was, Mint Street. If it's not the Tower of London, it's certainly Tower Hill across the road. There's the there's the crown, and then you've got the two England parts of the of the crest there. There's Scotland, the standing up lion, and there is the Irish harp. We've got Royal Mint across here. And I went, is that a Tudor rose? Not quite sure whether that's a Tudor Maybe. rose or not. It looks kind. It looks kind of like one. Oh, it's Nix, definitely. Can we get any? Oh, what was that? Oh yeah. There we go. Gorgeous. So that's the that's the token that comes, or used to come with the with the proof sets. Or it could be the castle from Aladdin, James. Yeah, maybe. The castle from <laughs> Aladdin. How do you get the focus back? <coughs> I don't know. I don't know. Right. So after that, oh sh sugar. sugar lumps. Yeah, there you just have to put it again. All right. I have to, oh. I can't get that. No. It's too far away from me. Yeah. My little arms. Without causing some damage. Crash, bang, wallop, as uh, Senor Colex yeah. would say. Agrabah, yeah. I think you're probably better off going. Oh, yeah, you've already gone in there. Mm, see. Okay. Sorry. See, Apologies. see. Everybody knows it's head. I edit all this out where I'm the king of open. But this time, people now know. Ooh. 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 What is this? I don't know. John Saunders says it's like Christmas opening all these parcels. Ooh. 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 So. Ooh. <laughs> Oops. Move that out of the way. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow, we. Looks awesome. Let's see what the letter says. To Bungle and Lady M, I'm sending you the Sainsbury's Makers of the Millennium Medal Collection. It is not a complete set, but if you keep it, if you keep it, you will be able to get the other medals off eBay from Robert Roberts. Oh, wow. Interesting. That's Robert <laughs> Roberts being kind to us rather than calling me thick, as he, uh, as he generally tries to do. So let's have a look. Two thousand into the millennium, Sainsbury's makers of the Millennium Medal Collection in association with the Guinness World Records. Well, mm -hmm. that is. That is fan fan dabby dozy. That there, I just zoom out, look yeah. so you can see it's a, it's a hell of a size, isn't it? Very nice. Wow, we. Let's have a let's have a little look. <whistles> Sainsbury's makers of the Millennium Medal Collection. Wow. Wow, look at that. Not many people have the chance to witness the end of the millennium. It's a special time. A time to celebrate those men and women whose vision and determination, flair and compassion have shaped the world we live in. Sainsbury's makers of the Millennium Medal Collection give us all a chance to take part in that celebration and to assemble a unique record of the event. Oh. Interesting. Wow, we. So I've never, I've not heard of this before. No. Let's see what we've, uh, we've got. I recognise Captain James Cook. He was born round here. Yeah. So it's something to do with uh, with time and the measuring thereof. Wow, this is uh, this is indeed. That's Einstein, I recognise him. Uh, there's Isaac Newton. Yeah. And there's the DNA double helix. DNA double felix. So we know that that was um. What's she called? Well, I took the photograph of it. Rosalind yeah, Franklin. Rosalind Franklin, that's it. Oh my goodness. Photograph goodness. 51. Yeah. There's Alexander Fleming. Oh, he was, yeah. He was, he, was he the penicillin guy? Yeah, penicillin. I, I remember that um, oh, someone, Laval, was it Robert Laval, born in 1822? Was that? He had something to do with it. He discovered penicillin and Laval did something else. Maybe it might have been a vaccine pox. or something. Might have been smallpox, yeah. Maybe. Remember that from history? Yes, vaguely. Wow. So we do the test tube baby there, yeah. Louise Brown. Oh, so this is basically talking about all the all the achievements, isn't it, before the, millen before the millennium? That's Leonardo da Vinci on all his amazing uh, inventions. Thomas Edison. James Watt. You what? Was that the light bulb? What? You what? You what? There's the Stevenson rocket. 
Cool. Wind turbines, Delilah. Oh, yeah. Or Delilah's mum and dad, maybe. Is that the suspen su suspension bridge? It looks maybe. like a suspension bridge, but I don't know where it is. Oh, oh it's not. Uh, oh, it is. It is Isn't yeah. bad Kingdom Brunel. Yeah. So the Industrial Revolution produced brilliant engineers who built bridges, roads, canals and railways. The most extraordinary career was that of Isambard Kingdom Brunel. He was a visionary who built the biggest ship in the world at the time, the Great Eastern and the Clifton Suspension Bridge, mm -hmm. saddling the Avon, Avon Gorge in Bristol and the amazing glass canopy of Paddington and the amazing glass canopy of Paddington Station in London. Mm -hmm. Paddington at the station. Yes. So the uh, Brunel's achievements and he looks he looks that looks he looks like his portrait he does, as well. Doesn't he? Yeah, John the best there you go. There he is, cool. isn't bad, Kingdom Brunel. So that is smashing that. Oh, I'm going to enjoy. Yeah, uh, I'm going to enjoy reading this. I'd like to go to Bristol. I'm sure it's Bristol. They've just um, oh, like done a sculpture about um, suicide awareness in in men. Oh, I'm sure okay. I saw that on Facebook today. Oh, was that the one where it was just sat inside a little um, yeah. like window thing? Yeah, so like you, sat it, back. As as a, it was, but there was a teddy bear stood next yeah. to it. Yeah, it was yeah. Cool, like that. So we definitely need to add Bristol to yeah. our list of. Uh, Things to do, lady. Yeah. I mean, I want to see that suspension bridge. I don't have like a good bridge since I turned thirty. <laughs> since no, as, you I, 30, as I've got yeah. older, you know, then uh, I really appreciate bridges and yeah. and scenery and things like that. So yes. yeah, we're definitely getting Bristol right, on our list. My bedtime reminders, come on. <laughs> right, yeah, we could go on. We could go on. This, this is. Let's, let's get to the. Uh, mm. Let's see where the the medal should be. Oh well, yeah, Robert there's, Roberts. There's one of my other favourite bears, Baloo. Oh yeah. Shakespeare. So Robert Roberts, you have really excelled yourself. Thank yeah. you very much. Oh, there's Mickey. There's Mickey. Mommy, me. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. This, yeah, I'm going to enjoy reading this. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh, right. There's, there's oh, the right. money shot, boys and girls. Oh, they cool as. So, the actual people. Yeah. Who can we? Who can we see on here? I've never seen Bill Gates. Right. So we've got. Alexander Fleming. We've got. That, uh, hang on. That? Alexander Graham Bell. Oh, he invented, okay. the, inverted, invented the dog and bone, didn't he? he did. Henry Ford for the cars. Oh, yeah. Christopher Columbus. Oh. Bill Gates. Jesse Owens. He was the. Um, the runner wasn't he in the um, world war oh the the olympics the, yeah the olympics 38 olympics or something yeah it's got the date on who was john harrison anybody know who john harrison is is he a mm, not sure jamesy i've got to work on tuesday <laughs> basically hurry up leonardo da vinci he yeah. was one of the turtles that's mahatma gandhi one of the turtles winston churchill oh we all know who he is first commoner on a coin William Shakespeare. Again, he's been on the odd coin, hasn't he? Yeah. Or his stuff. The Shakespeare triple. Vincent Instant Van Gogh. Or Van Gogh, if you're posh. You, is that Neil, Neil Armstrong. Armstrong. Muhammad, Muhammad Ali. Ali. That doesn't. That does not like Muhammad Ali to me. No. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> just just smacked Lady M in the face. Sorry about that, Lady M. Uh, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. Cool. And I is think we're there. So yes, Robert Roberts, Roberts, thank you very much. I will uh, certainly be looking on eBay to see which ones uh, are missing. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much for that. That is a great in the sleeve as well. Looks like a record player. Those of you, yeah. mind your vinyls. Oh, 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 oh we've got oh, a. Is that the complete? Yeah, bit? like a. Oh no, that must be oh, what, what's on the, the back. Side. Oh, that's so cool. it's showing you that. Let me just show you that. That must be the back on each coin. The two thousand and then the. The doodah. So yes, it looks like I suppose vinyl's trendy again, isn't it? Those of you who remember oh. vinyl records. Andrew Green is saying he works in Bristol. Oh Coast right. City. Very good. Touche McBoosh pineapple. Touche McBoosh pineapple. <laughs> saying I live in Gloucester. Uh, you and other coin tubers need to go to the Beatrix Potter shop by the cathedral. It's where she wrote the books. Oh, there you go. All right. Well, we have those of you that are following following our A to Z adventures. You'll know we've done for V for Villages. We went to Beatrix Potter's house. So Jude S and Cheryl M think that John Harrison was some kind of clockmaker. All right. Cool. 
Yeah. Thank you. Right, we've got three left, Lady M. Marine Cur Oh, right, okay, so Keith Cameron's added a bit more into there about John Harrison, so he says he was a Marine. Oh, you're testing me, you know, is it chron chronometer to help navigate at sea? Right, watch, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Right. No, well, well, actually, this says Bungle at the Magic Studio. Oh, right. Okay, so it's yours. Yeah. And it even says Bungle with a rainbow down it there. It does. So I'm afraid this is going to have yeah. to absolutely be me. So I'm impressed with this. Like this. It's come from Birmingham. We've got some candles or something on there. Yeah, it's like Christmas, isn't it? I think. Yeah. Or birthday, maybe. Yeah, and let's have a look yeah, at that. Yeah, I'm in the face. Sorry, again. Lady M. And there is a Bungle. John Saunders is saying nice one, Robert Roberts. Yeah. Fabulous. Right, let's have a... Oh, are you going out already? Look. I'm going in, I'm going in. I'm going in. Oh, dear me. Yes, that's my bedtime because I'm definitely yawning now. Not that that's anything new in the studio, but... Uh, <laughs> yes, it does do, annoy me. I do have a tendency to yawn. I'm going to have to just get in there. What's all the hashtag pocket points for? What's going on? I suspect it will be a disco, Discord yes, caper. Definitely. Your little Discord scamps. You crazy kids. Oh, wow. Oh, Keith Cameron's saying he remembers it from Only Fools and Horses. What? The, about the. Clock. Yeah, that's what made the millionaires, wasn't it? The, uh, the something watch. Oh, that's very posh. Mm -hmm. I like that. Look at that. Oh, this one says open first. So we're taking it lovely. Whoever's done this yeah, has gone to a lot. That's gonna say it. Look at that. Very fancy. Lovely, lovely. Right, let's check. Open first, open next. Oh well, it must yeah. be. Open nice. first and next. It must yeah. be okay for camera. Hope so. Anyway, it is very, very fancy. I right, better, I better double check. Yeah. Just I would hate to give something away. Oh, look at that. Oh wow. That's Look awesome. at that. Oh, is that what, what the hashtag pocket <laughs> points were? <laughs> right. Dear Bungle and Lady M, I hope this finds you well and all is well in the magic studio. Just a little note to say hi and can I redeem my points, hee hee. Mm. Mm, interesting. I have included a print for your studio and I can't wait to see the cat video. Well, the cat video's up, so yeah, that was up that uh, a week on Wednesday. So for the letter W for World Wide Web. And if anyone wants to know the difference between the World Wide Web and the internet, I can do that now. So just put in the, in the chat if you want to, if you want me to explain that again. I won't hold my breath. Um, and uh, la, 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 la. Merlin says hi, Merlin the cat. So look oh, at yeah. uh, look at that, and that is love from Pocket Poet. So Pocket po Poet is not only a beautiful individual, she, she is beautiful to look she at, is. no two ways about it as well, she, she is a, a lovely Gorgeous. lady, she's beautiful on the inside and out, and anyone out there would be lucky to have received this, and uh, I'm just impressed with the letters, never mind the, uh, <laughs> never mind the gift, oh, no, look at, that. That's look at this, stunning. so a Pocket Poet, it's so have a, look on, uh, have a look on Instagram, and you can follow Pocket Poet, so Obviously, clever. does poetry and lots of artistic things. That is absolutely stunning, isn't it? Though, isn't it? Yeah. Is it? Is it? How, how is it made? Is pocket point in? How? How? How is that made? Oh, look at that! <laughs> look at that! <laughs> James is saying pocket point is mine. You two hands off. No way. We can share. Well, you were lucky to have her, Jamesy. That's for yeah. sure. She's far too good for you, pal. <laughs> No two, no, two, no two ways about it. Look at... That oh, it's, is that boobs? It is, Get yeah. in, I'd love a boob shot. That has absolutely made my day, that. that are, are, they your, are they yours, Christina? I mean, that would be... That would be spectacular. Absolutely spectacular if it was a, if it was a, if it was a self portrait. Look at them bad boys. It's ink. It's pen and Oh, who cares what it's made of now? We're just, we're just, it's just all about the boobs now. Look at them. <laughs> Yowza, 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 hoo-wee! Honestly, you just, you totally spoiled yourself there. Oh, I just You're love boobs. So, so nice. Absolutely love boobs. So nice about how beautiful she was and that yeah. you get on the inside and out and then you just revert straight to the primal boob shot. 
<laughs> Master Temple is saying that it's uh, it's a wonderful work of art. Yeah, beautiful works of art. No yeah. two ways about it. Katie yeah, Jones stuck a couple of melons on. Cleavage shot. Yeah, it's definitely beautiful, Matt. I agree. Bungle's fave. No two ways about it. Absolutely. Uh, yowza, yeah. yowza. In fact, I'm just gonna. We don't need to look at anything else, do we? Can we just we just leave that in? <laughs> that is great. So it's very. So so what is this trying to say? This is trying to say. So say what? Breasts are like flowers. I don't know. Are they bosoms? Uh, blossoming bosoms. Buxom. I'm like. I want to use the word buxom here. Buxom. Blo- blossoming buxom. That's what it is. <laughs> I call it simply blossoming buxom. Okay. <laughs> there we go. That's my artistic face. Right. Fabulous. Definitely keep with all of that. This is uh, that's beautiful I as well, that. isn't it? It is. No, they yeah. are absolutely fantastic. Thank you. Thank you so much. Dylan Morris Muckoff. I like that name. Yes, we are safe and well. Thank yes. you very much. It's French. It's pronounced cleavage. B- Baps for supper, according to Andrew Baps Green. Baps supper. Blooming marvellous. <laughs> very good. How old are you? Edward Pugh wants to know how old I am. I am 30. So I've just turned 30. Right. Let's see what is next. So she's redeeming the. Uh, she's redeeming points. So Ooh. who knows? Is this our first... Top of a TV set. It's very small if it is. It only have to be a little bit. I don't know. I don't know. Michael Peckover is asking 2011 an IFC 50p or boobs. <laughs> I know the answer. <laughs> yeah. Boobs. Boobs every no day of the week. Life. Every day of the week. Oh, wow, it's an actual oh, TV set. That's awesome. That oh, is class. Poet, that's class. Yeah. Absolutely brill. You are gorgeous. What uh, what does it say? What is it? What yes, Raftery, it's coming up. Fabulous. That is super. Thank you. It's a mini TV. It's an actual whole telly. So that's very that is very good. That is very good, and that will go pride of place on the uh, on the gig shelf. We'll have it next to Star Lord and uh, Donald. Coin Collectella. He's saying, oh, Bungle, please do a video where you go to the National Gallery where you give a famous painting new names. <laughs> nah, I'm not going to the National Gallery, like. You know what I mean? Oh. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a modern man. Don't get me wrong, I'm a modern man. But, you know, art and mm. galleries, that's not really, yeah. you know. I'm, 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 a, I'm, a rock, I'm, a, I'm from the North East. I'm a traditional North East dude. Dude. Dude, you know, I don't, dude. don't like art and stuff like that. I like boobies. <laughs> Anyway, right, two packages left. So now this one, now I've already, you're gonna get a, an exclusive on this one because I've I've already opened this, um, and I couldn't. I, I've actually slight confession to make. Lady M already knows before anybody goes mad. Um, I filmed the coin hunt without Lady M, and that will upload on oh. Tuesday. So I went solo. I did a solo vid without Lady M for uh, for all you viewers' pleasure. And the reason why is when I picked up this. The, the P.O. box on Saturday or whenever it was earlier in uh, earlier in this week. Oh. <laughs> Coin collecting Ella, it's it's full of breast paintings, Bungle. You'd love it. Oh, well, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Yeah. Sounds good. So anyway, so I went to the P.O. box last week or early. I can't remember when it was. And uh, there was loads of parcels there. And this one was from Raftree. And I knew it included my new coin mat. So... The, those of you that are, are, are just getting used to the new 50p mat, this is the new 50p mat 2.0. Coin and, pick, uh, why I've are already you used unsubscribing? It. What's the matter? And I've already used it. Oh, don't ask coin pig who knows. Don't, don't go there. Don't go there. Just do what he needs to do. So this is, so this is the new, Ooh, fancy. this fancy is guy. the new coin mat. New colour? Yeah, so wow. we, we now we haven't gone for the colour. I've stuck with white for mine. So what I've done, I spoke to Mark at Raftery, and you'll know those of you that I think I've only done maybe one or two. The gold, silver, and bronze finds, and then I had green for the Olympic finds. Well, I didn't like the green. I wanted to be a little bit more like our two pound mat. Let me move. Let me zoom in. I wanted to be more like our two pound mat, where it was simply gold, silver, and bronze. So I bought one off Raftery with it with a white background that I've already say I filmed a couple of episodes using it. And uh, this is the 50p mat 2.0. So we've got gold finds, gold, silver, and bronze. The the ones we don't know, the mintage figures, are still uh, are not coloured in now. We've got the plum finds in, in the corner. And uh, my silver finds have gone all the way up to Paddington at the Palace. They, they ended about here, so I wanted a little bit of a tweak there. 
So yeah, this is it. This is this is this is an exclusive. Dylan Morris Muckoff's got a joke for you. What do you call the London Underground full of professors? Tuba Smarties. Yep. I just read it. Um, so uh, Mark from Raftry has been kind enough as well. So I bought one and paid for the postage, and he very very cleverly decided to maximise on that postage and sent this. So this is part of our members giveaway for September. So not only will you get, not only will you get a wrestling, put it in here, I was, I was fully prepared. Not only will you get, he says, kind of, come on, come on. And I say, I'm not plugging for, for members here, I'm just explaining, honest. So not only will you get the wrestling coin, which is a previous plum find, you'll also get the, the coin tuber mat as well the new version wow 50p 2.0 uh, with the blue background so thank you very much to raftry for uh, providing uh, that for us and there'll also be some bungle bank notes as well in there so i'll throw a bit of bit of bungle bank notes in for a bit of daft kind of like to say ooh, eggshell blue very yeah well i've well i've stuck with white because white's our white's our color on the black background but if you want to yeah you can win what you become a member 99 pence a month september's prize draw um, is one of them mats or you can go over to Raftree and buy one I think they're a tenner I paid a tenner and four quid postage so thanks uh, thanks for that so all you members got a chance of winning that that'll be on the first, last day of September or the first day of October Coin Patrol is saying that you should collect uh, old comic postcards loads of boobs I've got thousands of them yeah I've seen your postcards <laughs> uh, Coin Patrol no he puts them um, when he does a live stream and that he'll Oh, he cuts right. to a few, you know, the old, uh, um, the old seaside oh, humour. Right, I'm with you. Yeah. Oh, it's Absolutely. quite light considering how big it is. That's what this is. Darren Cheshire is liking the mat. Very good. All right. Right. So last one. This is yeah. it, and all of a sudden we're on the last box. We are on the last package. Well, it's definitely my turn. Oh. I'm careful, Sorry. lady. I'm just trying not to. Cut my own arm off. Mind it be day for it tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Drew Watson is saying the moment we've all been waiting for. Oh. Su Suzanne William James loves the new mat. Don't cut me yet. Don't cut me lead, will you? On there. This and this. Whoever sent this, it cost them six pound ninety to send this. It must wow. be because of the size. Yeah, it's certainly not the weight. No, it is very light. <laughs> I don't. Lady Anne's pulling a funny face. Right, I'm gonna go down the sides. We can all just bear with us while Lady M tries to yeah. put her open. Let me tell you about next week. So what we'll probably do is get to the post office on Saturday, the PO box. We have to go and pick our mail up. So we'll go on Saturday. So if we've received any mail last week or this week, we will open it uh, live next Sunday. But we're doing 10, 10 a.m. And uh, you can blame Lady M for that. Lady M wants to go early rather than late because it's past her bedtime. I am not a night owl. No, and we are, we are more early doors than um than than late. I'm not really a morning person either but No, she's more <laughs> she's more morning than she is late. She's kind of around about eleven, she's alright for an hour. Yeah. Um and then after that she's uh, a cranky self. So <laughs> So yeah, so next week, next Sunday, ten AM, if we have some posts to open, we will uh, we will open any posts we got last week or this week. Right. And we might even do a coin on two knows. Yes. Right, is it ready for the opening, is it? Yeah. Is there any evidence in there? Uh have a quick look. You now know. You now know what it is. Oh, I like the paper. Right. Yeah. No, you're okay. No. You can. Uh, Are we reading it first? Should I read the letter first? Uh, uh. Yeah. No, I think you need to. Uh, I think you just need to go for it. So open it. Yeah. Just don't knock the camera. Oh no. Oh dear. Camera's just gone. The camera has gone. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> there with us folks if you can still hear us oh we're back Ta -da! we're back but oh we'll just better check can it, can it, are we there yeah i think we can see it can everyone see us and the and the package and hear us can you hear us hello <laughs> the gremlins for the foot before the final reveal yeah anybody there drew watson saying drum roll all good all good we're there Excellent. right so you know what this is is it exciting is it worth opening yeah. Or should we just wait till next week? Should we, <laughs> should we leave it there and then just we, we make this the first package next day, next Sunday? No, you definitely need to go for it. Everyone can, oh, can hear us. Coin Pig saying who was saying that. Andrew <laughs> Watson, 
Dave Chamberlain, Nanny Sue, hello. Tom Scrafton. Right, are we ready then? Yep. We're just opening it up. Yep, just mind the camera. Wow, way. <laughs> wow, way. To Bungle and ADM, we love watching your channel, not just for the great coins, but also for the entertainment factor. You both have such great personalities. Thank you. Christopher Glex told us to send you the top of our tellies to redeem our points, so please find and close the front of our telly. We are looking forward to seeing what our prizes will be. Ha ha. <laughs> Keep up the great work from Andrew Watson and the Watson family. Brilliant. P.S. We hope to get to say hello one day at the Mint. Definitely. I love the fact you've got our... How awesome did you, paper. Yeah, how did, how, did you get our, how did you get our logo on the, on the, on the sheet of paper? Not sure. <laughs> it looks good. Oh, <laughs> flip the neck. Oh, that is class. <laughs> oh, you can't quite see because of our... Uh, because of the camera, so I'll have to have a, uh, have to have a read that way, I think. Yeah. So, redeeming my points, courtesy of Christopher Collects, the front of my TV, <laughs> from the Watson family. Ah, uh, got Christopher stickers on it. Yeah, well, I guess you have to happen to say, Pocket Point, give us a little mini TV, <laughs> but this is actually the this is actually the front, uh, isn't it? Yeah. This is the... Yeah, this is definitely the front, I can tell the, you. The screen would be behind uh, it, so there, there's yeah. the top, and it? This, this would yeah, be the top thing. The, so that lights would come on and stuff. Oh yeah, it just it just had to happen, didn't it? That happened yeah. sooner or later. <laughs> wow, what do we think oh, of that? We could, we could use it as a frame for something, couldn't we? Well, it's definitely going up on the. Uh, it's yeah. definitely going to go up on on the wall. We could frame some of the. Uh... Yeah, we could put uh, pocket poets boobs on it, couldn't we? <laughs> we'll stick it. Oh, yeah, should we, we should a... we do it live? Should we shall we do it live? Let's see if we we'll can get a back for it. Hang and, on, uh... I'll let you let you read the comments. Six pound ninety, Christopher collects. You should definitely be redeeming oh, yeah. um, the the Watson family's post. Oh yeah. So. Oh oh yeah. Oh, now we just look ridiculous, <laughs> don't we? <laughs> yeah, cool. Right, right I'll let you read the comments. I'm putting this. Okay. This is going up live. This is this is decorating with bungalow. So right, everybody's saying it's finally happened. Amazing, laughing faces. Um. Remind me not to make an appointment on the Monday morning, please. Um, Crime Patrols is great stuff. Drew Watson, please show some love to my dad. Influenced me to make the stickers and paper for this. Oh, yeah, awesome. Who was that? Brilliant. Drew Watson. Drew Watson, thank you. Um, John Saunders, would it go over the coin mat? Oh yeah, you could. Oh yeah, it does. Coin mat. Oh, that is awesome. What a. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, it does actually. Yeah. Spot on. Can someone can someone screenshot that for me? Good and, idea, John Saunders. And, and send that as a messenger. That actually fits. Perfect. Oh, that is absolutely spot on. Yeah. Oh, no, then it's not good because you look at the screen. Oh. Yeah. Hang on. Right, we we just... we we'll have to take a picture of it. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. We can. Oh, coins to collect says the uh, boobs of the week frame. Boobs of the week, <laughs> Trev. That's brilliant. Oh, that is brilliant. Oh, Trev, if, we, if we if we get bo boobs of the week, we'll definitely do an after dark. Oh, Andrew but, well. Watson says wicked coin collector. Coin, coin collector is amazing. Uh, coin pig says once you have thirty three TV tops, the novelty will wear off. Yes, it absolutely will. Um, Love it. So, would someone yeah. can someone coin. take a? Coin Collectella agrees with uh, Trev. Coins to collect. So someone take Perfect a screenshot. Yeah. So someone take a screenshot of that for me and message it to me. I can't get it now because I'm using my phone. But absolutely brill. That is cool. Why don't you use your iPhone? <laughs> Does that not make sense? Well, no, the internet will do the work, look. Oh, it's all right. Joking. So I'm putting this up live. So it, look, it looks great, but and obviously it will get in the way when we're coin hunting, and it needs to have a permanent place yes well until it drops off because it's quite heavy and i'm going to try and stick it to glass so we'll have to we'll have to see or i'll try and hang it up or something but let's see whether we can get it up oh there's daddy long legs in now i do not oh, like them yeah, that it's is a big, big. it is a big one. Oh, uh andrew green says boobs of the week versus christopher's a to z redesign <laughs> i tell you what we're onto something here <laughs> We are absolutely onto something. Please don't start sending in pictures of boobs. <laughs> Please do. Please do. No, La Lady honestly, M also appreciates a nice pair of boobs as well. Yeah, I don't, honestly, 
I, I look at a pair of boobs. I appreciate the form of them, but don't start. <laughs> Jamesy, before you even say anything, do not send the D. No, whatever. definitely do not. Whatever. I do not appreciate that form. <laughs> See enough of them. <laughs> That is absolutely class, that. Absolutely superb. Yeah. So I'm not sure how long that will stay up for. Because it is on the glass of the Trev's Magic took Studio. The picture and I sent it to you. Thank you, Trev. I'm sure what Trev will do. It will look fantastic as well when Trev's bad yeah, time. Yes, definitely. Trev's finished very, with it. Right, let's get some. Professional. Let's get some postcards up there as well. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely get them oh, in. I, I probably use too much. Oh, I'm really, I'm on, I'm on rations here. Oh, you'd be okay. Right, you won't need that. You don't need much for the post. No, we just put two at the top, yeah. can't we? Right, there you go. I'll do, uh, I'll do mine. You I'm, do I'll, 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 I'll handle pocket you points. The, you do the boobs. Don't, uh, don't, don't worry, don't worry about that. Pocket point, your boobs are in safe, safe hands. hands. <laughs> I've got plenty of experience <laughs> in boobage. Boob handling. Lady M is a, a coin boober herself. <laughs> Apparently, yeah, that's a that's a term. F female coin tubers are coin boobers. That's been if that, honestly if that thing comes near me, I'm off. And genuinely like running away. <laughs> Which is the title of my sex tape, I think. Okay, next one. <laughs> oh, that is superb. That. Right. Any more messages? Every creepy crawly thing has definitely come into the studio tonight, like. So Andrew W was saying, can't believe it actually happened. Saves me from being the first to do it. Yeah. The night coin pig. What's gonna? How's anyone? How's anyone gonna top that? I know. That's the. That's, uh, uh, that's the. That's the thing, isn't it? Oh, let me just pick up that uh, oh, fantastic. Yes. yes, don't lose that. Proof there. I'm gonna stick that. That there for the nice minute. shot of buggy uh, of buggies of bungles saggy back backside oh yeah he's terrible for pulling his shorts off i've got no bum it's i'm all i'm all belly and no bum yeah I'm jerry's afraid. saying boob alicious boob alicious is, is there anything else we can stick i think that's probably mind we run out of blue tack anyway yes, now or no pink more blue tack. pink tack as it is yes so yeah that is uh that is fabulous yeah Awesome. Oh, right, is it time for bed then, Lady I M? Is, so. it is, it yes, is it time for bed? It's definitely past my bedtime. Pl please do stick a, a like on the uh, on the stream before you go. And it's been a pleasure um, being with you. Thank you. Hope uh, let us know what you think of the PO box opening. How many people have you got watching? Uh, 123. 123 people watching them. Amazing. Open our post. Absolutely fantastic. So, um, unbelievable coins has enjoyed it. Yeah. We said goodnight to Coin Pig. Hashtag Coin Boobers. Yep. Alright. Uh, Andrew W is gonna catch Nothing up on it. Last is great stream peeps. Got any uh, wait, uh what's it say? Wayne Saunders. Got an idea for tip tomorrow. Oh no. <laughs> is the screen's jumping and I'm reading two different things? I'm going to the tip tomorrow. I'll see if there's an old fifty inch flat screen I can pick up. Yeah, it's gonna take some top in that, isn't it? Yeah. Coin, coin control saying carry on to the midnight we can't late i'm no. under orders lady m said no matter what um she needs she needs to go to bed at a reasonable hour so we've already been on longer than we thought i think yes cheryl m liked it andrew green liked it sas toast i'm going to ignore that shuri wait likes the banter great stream thank you coin collecting hella ella ella <laughs> Under my umbrella, Ella. Coin collecting, Ella, Ella. Great fun, thank you. You're welcome, Scarlett. Last time there was as many people watching, it was a cranky's party, honestly, Jamesy B. <laughs> Hoy. See you later, Emily. Thank you so much for the uh, for the super chats. Thank you very yes, much for the receive. Thank you for the guys. two people that have joined to become members. Yeah. Really, really appreciate that. Drew Watson on the wall, yeah, indeed absolutely. it is. It is indeed. Pride of place. Uh, Jay Coyne is saying fantastic stream. 
Jerry's saying great steam. What we do? Yes, yeah, so we're going to do another one. Ten o'clock, ten a.m. Yes. Next Sunday. Well, after we get any any mail, so we'll be going Knock, to the PO box the on Saturday, and uh, we'll be picking up with the mail, and we'll do we'll do the same again Saturday morning. Back to our ten a.m. live yes. streams. You might even do a coin hunt. You never know. We might uh, have the odd coin there. Dylan Morris muck off says we hate the bit the Bond ten P. We like beef for boobs. Totally agree. <laughs> Totally agree, Tracy Murg Murgatroyd. Hello, miss you next Sunday night. Yeah, it's blame Lady M. Blame Lady M. Sorry, guys. She needs a beauty sleep, I she do. says, and she doesn't. She doesn't. She needs to improve her haircutting skills. I look like I've, I've got a ball on my head. Look, you don't. I do. We'll have to see how to get back to my quiff around, swift around. It's just because it needs washing. Yeah, no, I've done all right, love. I'm impressed. Bungle after dark once a month, please. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, maybe every so often we might do a late one, but uh, yeah. predominantly it needs to be during the day. I think we've got to thank Christopher as well, haven't we? Appreciate it, Christopher, for, for sending some uh, people yes. our way. Thank and if you, you are new much. to the channel, please do uh, consider subscribing as well. Right, these these uh, these goodbyes are just far too yes. long, aren't they? I just, on, I just, I just don't, I don't want to go through it. I want to get the two pounds out. You know, I want a two pound hunt, but uh, no, the right. boss, the boss of sport. Right, Working okay on. then. Thank you very much yes, for joining thanks, us. Guys. Massive thank you to everyone who sent something in. Please don't oblige to be obliged to send anything in, although we do like free gifts. Um, a postcard is more than enough. Um, it Especially really if is. It's got boobs on. Yeah, boob. Yeah, boob pictures. <laughs> I'm up for them. Any any time, <laughs> messenger. Um, you know, Instagram. You can they, they can send them anytime. But no, seriously, PO box. Uh, a picture, a postcard. Uh, just a letter is absolutely amazing. It gives yeah. us great content. We really, we really do, and we really do enjoy uh, open it, open our mail, and say we thought we'd try something a, a little bit different. So, see you, Chris. See you, Coin Fan. See you, John. See you, Jerry. See you later, uh, Touch McBoosh. Special little pineapple. See you, Richard. See you, Nanny Sue. And uh, we might see you next Sunday, 10 a.m. Yeah. for more Plum Post.